Look at me. You need to stay with me. Help's on the way, okay? You need to... You need to be a guy when they... When they get here. Okay. I, I'm not going anywhere. Sorry, Andrew, but it looks like this time you're gonna have to sit this one out. Anyways, welcome back, True Believers, and all you spectacular Spidey fans to another really interesting Spider-Man PS4-related video. Now, this is going to be an extremely quick status update because everyone is obviously stoked that the Raimi suit is finally implemented within Spider-Man PS4, and even more so as a free skin within the newest update. And given all the costumes that we have in the game up to this point, we do have almost the entirety of every single Spider-Man movie costume that has been made thus far, including that of the same. Sam Raimi suit and the majority of the MCU suits, excluding that though of Far From Home. So now the only suits that appear to remain in terms of movie costumes is that from the Mark Webb franchise of Spider-Man movies, also known as the Amazing Spider-Man series with both Andrew Garfield Spider-Man costumes from the Amazing Spider-Man 1 and the Amazing Spider-Man 2. However, if you are a gigantic fan of those movies, I do have some upsetting news for you because James Stevenson, who is indeed the community director at Insomniac Games, did flat out confirm that those suits will not be appearing in Spider-Man PS4. So basically, James Stevenson posted this GIF after finally releasing the Raimi suit onto Spider-Man PS4's recent update of saying, are you not entertained? And even though James posted this in a joking manner, someone still decided to respond to him asking about whether or not we could see other suits from the other Spidey movies be in Spider-Man PS4. And as you see here, fellow Twitter user Matthew Rampage messaged James Stevenson on Twitter saying, now the crying brats got what they wanted, will you be releasing the TASM suit? And as you can see, James Stevenson flat out said, Hell no. So given how we already got a majority of the MCU suits within the main game, and the Raimi suit was held off for a secret surprise for the holiday season, James Stevenson and everyone at Insomniac have finally come out and flat out confirmed that the TASM suits will not be in the game. So overall, what do I think about this? Well, for me personally, I do really love the first suit from The Amazing Spider-Man 1, because I do think that is a extremely unique design out of all the other Spidey costumes that we have in the past. Not to mention that the overall design of the first suit from Amazing Spider-Man 1 is a huge factor of inspiration for the advanced suit within Spider-Man PS4 in general. As for the Amazing Spider-Man 2 suit, it is clearly the ultimate Spider-Man comic book costume brought to life on screen, but in my opinion, I much rather prefer that we have the Raimi suit in the game compared to this one since it already looks similar to the classic suit. So like we already know, Insomniac and Marvel did go to Columbia Pictures to get the legal rights in order to use that suit within the game and already had the Raimi suit planned months ahead of time before the game actually released. And even though I'm not too sure which specifications Insomniac need to have in order to use which precise suit in the game, I do think if they already have a majority of the MCU suits as well as the Raimi suit, I do think that's already enough for me. Still, I do know a lot of fans out there of the Andrew Garfield Spider-Man movies may be a bit upset to know that we will not be receiving this suit in the game anytime soon. There is still a chance that we could receive it in the upcoming sequel. But just as I was towards the Raimi suit, I am in different towards the Amazing Spider-Man suits being within Spider-Man PS4, even though I really do like the first one, I'm not too heartbroken that it will not be in the game. And like I said earlier, I am fine with the second Amazing Spider-Man suit not being in the game since we already have a lot of classic looking suits in the main game already. But anyways guys, that's the quick update video I have for you today, and please let me know all your thoughts in the comments section down below. What do you think of the Amazing Spider-Man suits confirmed to not be within Spider-Man PS4, and do you wish that they would put them in the game if you are a huge fan? For me personally, after all the Raimi suit drama, I'm just so relieved that Insomniac and Marvel finally came out and flat out debunked that certain suits will not be in the game, given what the Amazing Spider-Man suits are looking like to be not featured in it. But still, given how detailed the Raimi suit as well as all the MCU suits look in the game, I would actually like to see what the TASM suits would have looked like within Spider-Man PS4, but still, I'm not too crushed about it. But anyways guys, please let me know what you think about this in the comments section down below, and until next time, true believers, stay spectacular Spidey fans, peace out.